All right, party people. We're live for a limited time. Shorter stream today. I do have the trick or trade Pokemon booster bundle. So funny. I, I don't I don't know if it'll ever not be funny. But I think that's probably the point. But this thing comes with 50 mini packs, which is pretty sick. Is it, dude, like, oh, that new pack smell, it's actually insane. It smells so good. It's like freaking, oh, look at, look at this. So I had a very spooky idea. All right, I'm going to stop doing that. But anyway, I had kind of a crazy idea. My idea was this. So what I was thinking was, because there's 50 in here, right? I was thinking about opening obviously a really small amount of these and opening just a little bit at a time so we can kind of stretch it out and then next month i was thinking about opening more so i was going to open like you know one pack a day for the whole month of october until until halloween you know that's what i was thinking i think that'd be pretty lit but what do you guys think I'm curious to see what we get in here. I wonder if we're going to get anything hype. And is there a TCG code is the question. Oh, there's not a TCG code. Okay. I don't want to spoil it for myself, but hey. Dude, look at that little Pikachu pumpkin. So sick. So Sinisty. Ooh. A holographic Marshadow. Rapid Strike. And then... Graveyard. That's sick. So wait, what is the what does Marshadow do? Rapid hunt. Search your deck for up to two rapid strike cards. Reveal them and put them into your hand. Then shuffle your deck. Shadow flicker. If the defending Pokemon is knocked out during your next turn, take one more prize card. What the heck? Oh my gosh. Marshadow is pretty cool. Whoa! Even the pumpkin's holographic. Did you guys notice that? Let me see. Let me see if we can get it to focus. What up? I'll see. It's kind of hard to catch it on camera. You can barely see it, but the pumpkin, the pumpkin's literally holographic. That's so dope. I'll definitely put that one on a sleeve. It's super sick. All right, so I still have still have forty nine more of these, and there's no there's no like uh, TCG live code or anything with these, which is kind of nice. You don't have to worry about it. But yeah, but also kind of sad. It's like oh man. All right, let's see what we have here have a Poltegeist. Ooh. Holographic Pikachu. Nice. And your Floon. Okay. The Holographic Pikachu is pretty cool. Do these all have hollows in them? Like, guaranteed? I wonder, but... Man, these are so sick. I feel like I need to be a little more careful because I'm used to having so many cards. So I'm not used to it. And I think I might have almost bent this card right now. If not, I did bend it. So I'm going to have to be careful. I'm just not used to it. For the packs to be like this small, you know? <laughs> I'm just not used to that. I'm used to the, there being like 10 or 11 cards, including the including the TCG live code. So I'm just used to there being more. I'm just gonna have to be a little more careful because these packs open really easily. So I, I'm not used to that either. I'm used to the packs like, you know, you kind of have to force them open a little bit, right? Or sometimes I have to use like scissors. We get Duskull. Ooh, holographic chandelure. Really nice. And 
some drift blim. I need another drift blim anyways, because I've had so many drift limbs. Mountain roasting. When you play this Pokemon from your hand to evolve one of your Pokemon during your turn, you may discard the top three cards of your opponent's deck. That's pretty sick. And 90 damage is... That's fun. I wouldn't say it's anything like, you know, to write home about, but it's still pretty cool. I'll put it in a sleeve. I'll try to put all the, all of them in a little, little plastic one. Plastic sleeve. Wonder if anyone else is on today. What's up? Just claiming my gems real quick. So I've already opened up three packs, so 48 packs. I'll probably do like, what, maybe, maybe four today? I don't know, maybe five? I'm Honestly, I'm just more curious on what we can get in here. If there's anything that's like super rare, but I kind of doubt it. But I'd have to look into it because... That's part of the reason why I bought these, is I was curious to see, like how much, um, like how much cards were gonna be in there and all that, but I didn't know for sure. So we get Dusk Clubs. Ooh, and Dusk Anor. This one's super sick. Wow, and Miss Magus. Wow. That's super sick. So we got Dusk Hole in the other one, and then we get the Dusk Duskinor. Spooky Shot does 120. Spectral Breach. All special energy attached to Pokemon. Both yours and your opponents provide one. Wait, provide one energy and have no other effect? Oh, wow. So you can literally shut down like double turbo and stuff. That's actually really cool. So you effectively just kind of make them, kind of make them like mess up their deck in that way, if he's alive. And 120 is a pretty decent amount of damage for only, for only three. It's pretty good. Could be better. Shoot. <laughs> I don't know what I want to do with these now. Darn it. Because there's so many of them. And they're only the three packs. I'm used to just, I'm used to opening the... The bigger ones, you know? I'm not sure. I'm sure what I want to do. It is super cool, though, regardless. Like, I still really like it. The whole concept with the little pumpkins is super cute. Super freaking cute. I love that. So open up four. I'll do one more. One more, one more. Five total. I think it's funny that the pack says three additional game cards, like there's going to be the TCG Live code in there, but there is no TCG Live code in there. So I wonder if that's in at least one of the packs. I'm curious. I kind of doubt it. So far what's cool is we're getting we're getting like stuff we, we would need if we wanted to run a deck with these. Litwick. Ooh, and Houndstone, really cool. And Murkrow, heck yeah. With United Wings, United Wings is pretty sick. Last Respects, this attack does 10 more damage for each Psychic Pokemon in your discard pile. That one could be pretty cracked, low key, but it's, the problem is it's only 80 base. If it was like a hundred base, and then you could do, you could have like ten Mons and or ten Psychic Pokemon. Ah, oh, see, it's it's still too much of a risk. That's the problem. I'm like trying to think about it right now. It would have to be, I'd have to be like one twenty or one forty, and then with that one forty, if you had like six Pokemon dead, you basically lose anyways. Cause what is it? Yeah. For each psychic Pokemon in your discard pile, so it means you're gonna have to Ultra Ball. You have to, you're gonna have to Ultra Ball a lot. Discard psychic Pokemon. You're gonna have to only run psychic Pokemon. You're gonna have to Nest Ball. So you basically have to burn through your whole deck. That sounds so risky. But either way, we did five. 
So, 45 left. Not bad. Not bad at all. Super freaking dope. The fact that you get 50 packs and with GameStop's whole, like, you know, pro rewards thing, not a sponsor. <laughs> you you get an extra $5 off. So it was only $20 for that whole entire thing, which is pretty cool. So the fact that it was 20 bucks, I think, is pretty sick. Because it just makes it makes it a little more enticing, you know?